everyone, it's Rebel Ann Dahl here. I'm sorry about the sound issues with this film. Apparently I was recording the whole time with my battery in my microphone dead, so this tutorial and the next tutorial are going to be voiced over. This tutorial is the hair part of a two-part series for the character of Abaddon from the TV show Supernatural. I will put a link to the makeup tutorial in this video or in the description below. This hair look, uh, a lot of people tend to do the French twist to it. And there is use of the French twist in what I'm doing, but if you look at the photos from the show or you watch episodes of the show, you can see that her hair is a little more decorative than a simple French twist. For this tutorial, you're going to need a round brush a comb, hair clips, hair pins, hair spray, and I also am using a simple hair brush just to brush my hair out before I get started. To start with, you're going to separate out your bangs. I go from corner of my forehead to the other corner. And then you're going to twist that up and pin it up so that it's out of the way. Next you're going to take your hair from about the top of your ears all the way back and you're going to pin that up and out of the way just like you did your bangs. With the remaining hair, you gather that up and comb it so that it looks nice. Then you twist it like you would a French twist, pulling it up and into itself. Then you pin it into place. Now you're going to want to separate a small bit of hair from the rest of it and pin up the extra to the side and out of your way. With that small bit of hair that you separated out, you're going to want to twist it into a small pin curl and then pin it down at the base of the French twist you started. Repeat the pin curl step two to three more times with the remaining hair until all of the hair of this first section is pinned down. Now you're going to take the next section of hair and comb it back so it is as nice as you can get it. If there are some loose bits, don't worry too much because you can always pin it in place and smooth it out with hairspray at the end. Now you're going to do with this section of hair what you did with the first section of hair. Twist it up tight and underneath itself like you would a French twist, then pin it into place. Then you're going to separate out small little sections of your hair and create pin curls until all of the hair is pinned down. Now we're going to start working on our bangs. We're going to tease them so that they can have a little more of a poof to the front. To tease your hair, just take your comb and push down a little towards the root of your hair. Once you're done teasing your hair, you're going to pull your bangs back and down towards the right side. Then you're going to pin it down near the front. Then you're going to pin the tail of it back towards where you have your pin curls so it all looks nice and neat. Now you're going to want to take all of those loose hairs and pin them back so that they're nice and flat against your head. 
Now you're going to take your hairspray and spray it all over your hair. This will help to both hold the hair in place and to smooth out all of those flyaways. And to smooth out the flyaways, you're going to take your round brush and brush everything down. So those are all the steps and this is the finished look. You can see back here in the back that all the pin curls kind of look like how they do in the picture. And then you also have the bang bump in the front. Here are two examples of the finished product from Supernatural Con Las Vegas this past year. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Also, the link to my Facebook page and my Twitter page will be located in the description box below. If you like this video and you would like to see more of my videos, please subscribe. Until next time, peace out, babes!